Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to be showing you how to animate parts and make them play with Moon Animator. This is very simple. I'm going to leave a, uh, a link to the plugin in the description, Moon Animator, right here. It's very easy to use. It's just like the regular Roblox animator. But yeah, let's get into it. So, um, I created this model, tutorial model. And it's just a basic model with a couple parts. A base, these two parts that are just named part, and then one and two. One and two are the parts that we're going to animate. You can an anchor every part in the model except one and two. Or anchor every model except the parts that you're going to animate. And make sure your model has primary part set to the base part. Which is basically like, this is the base part down here. Now with Moon Animator, it's going to come with this Easy Weld right here. And this is what we're going to use to make the Motor 6Ds to be able to animate. So open Easy Weld, select Parts, and then you want to click on Base, your base part. Hold Control, select 1, and then select 2, and then click Join in Place. And it'll weld them together with animatable Motor 60s. Also, make sure when you're doing that, that animatable is uh, true. And after you do that, you're ready to animate. So you want to click, you want to open Moon Animator, and you want to click File. And you want to click new animation and just name it test or whatever you want to name it and now like i said it's just the uh animation editor on roblox so just click this little plus right here select your model and then select rig and c frame and then click ok and then you're ready to animate so i'm going to select part one create a keyframe moving it to here and then move this slider over Select part two, move it over here, and then s move the keyframe over again. Select part one, move it over here, and then do this again one more time with part two. So it's just like kind of a loop. And then we're gonna, if you want your animation looped, you can click this little loop icon right here and go ahead and play it. It's gonna be kind of a messy loop. You can change um, like the way the animation moves. If you select all the keyframes and go to uh i think it's uh where is it yeah edit animation settings i don't know wait i haven't used this in a minute it's somewhere around here it's like edit track items or something like that yeah right here track you want to go to track and then edit track items and then you can set it to like cubic out like that and it's kind of it's smoother like that so say this is the animation I want to keep you want to export it so you want to go to file oh, no you want to go to you want to go to item and then you want to go to export all and it's going to create a little folder yeah I'm not going to save that uh, it's going to create a little folder in server storage called moon animator export you want to right click on what on the uh, the model it created the keyframes right click on that blue thing Click save to Roblox, name it whatever you want, and then submit. And then you want to copy this ID right here with this little button. And now if you want the animation to like play in game, we can use an animation controller instead of like just a humor since it's not like an actual player. You want to right click on your model, insert object, animation controller, and then right click again, insert an animation. And in your animation, you want to paste it. Uh, animation ID of the animation you just created and you also want to create a script and in this script you're gonna type um, I'll just do wait five make sure everything's like in and then we can just do animation or script dot parent dot animation controller animation controller load animation script dot parent dot animation play so what it's gonna do is get this animation controller it's going to load this animation and then play it simple as that so let's go ahead and click play here and then after five seconds of loading in the animation start playing on this model right here yeah as you can see it starts sliding it's the same animation we created i think you can 
if it's welded like this, like how we did, like these motor 60s, I think you can still use the regular Roblox animation right here like that. Yeah, see, you can, you can animate it just like this with the regular Roblox animator. So you don't have to use moon animator. You can only use, you can use, you can use moon animator to weld it, but you can animate it with the default one. But yeah, if this video helped you, you can join my Discord server, link in the description below if you need any help. And yeah.